Look, I'm not even finna hold y'all. I'm disappointed. I'm just honestly disappointed, you know, in, in some of the way you guys be acting. Some of y'all, listen, I know that it's way more beta males out there. It's way more guys that's going to simp, you know, and who am I to say you shouldn't validate a female? If you enjoy being a female's guinea pig, if you enjoy being led around in a circle, not getting no action, she just playing with your head and not the head you want played with. Who am I to tell you that's the wrong way to live your life? Because you might enjoy it. I'm getting to the point where I just think some of y'all just lost complete sense of yourself. These females have just totally taken control over y'all. Some of y'all love bowing down. I'm not trying to start no gender bias bullshit. I'm not with that agenda. I don't hate women at all. I'm just honestly, I'm baffled at the way that y'all be letting these females degrade you. It's just, it's astonishing. Y'all need to understand that it always comes down to a battle of control. It's all about control with women. And when they control you, it's a wrap. You're, you're done. You're done. You are lower than yourself. And the crazy thing is, y'all will literally believe that this is how you get females to like you. How you get they draws. This is not how you go about doing it. And it's crazy, because I just had an experience. Took beta male simping to a whole new level. I'm talking about more than a nigga that make up excuses, more than a nigga that'll sit here and validate a chick. This took validation to a new fucking level. So I'm out, I meet a couple people I know, and I'm introduced to a couple new guys, right? Now, we also met two chicks right then and there. We all talking and stuff, listen, I'm cool. I like to do my own thing, I leave the group. I'm like, okay, I'm going to go out solo, do my own thing. That's how I like to move, all right? I come back about 15, 20 minutes later. I'm looking on the dance floor. Nigga, I'm finna use a word I ain't never used before. I was disheveled. Nigga, I was disheveled. I look at these motherfuckers. Bro, I literally see this chick take this nigga hand, turns this nigga around, Bends him over, puts her hand on the top of his head. This nigga is grinding on her. Like, he the female. Like, she got the dick. Like, she got the package. What kind of bullshit? What is going on here, guys? What is really going on here? What is going on here? You lost. You lose. You just lost life. And this ain't GTA. You ain't got no more life. Your health bar is done forever. I've never, bruh, this is the craziest shit. But the same dude, when I was talking to him right before, this nigga, oh man, yeah, I talk to any females that I want. I get whatever I want. And at that point, yeah, all right, nigga. I don't believe shit you saying. I don't believe a damn thing. Then her friend, the other girl that was in the group, grabs his friend and does the same shit. These niggas is having a twerking contest on these bitches, trying to see who twerk better. Then after it's done, these girls literally rate them. These girls are rating these niggas. Well, I think he danced better on... Let's switch. This shit... Y'all, this, this is crazy. This is crazy. I'm going to tell y'all something I damn near snap. I'm usually calm, cool, collected. Um, emotionally content. Like, I don't really let shit phase me, bother me. I must have had too many drinks that night. You know what I'm saying? And, and that, that shit just hurt me. I try to keep the shit on the low, but hey, I had to pull the nigga aside like, bro, what the fuck are you doing? And what this nigga said to me was, I'm just having a good time. We're, we're having a good time. I'm enjoying my time. I'm like, you know what? It just clicked in my head right then. It just, everybody ain't the same. You know what I'm saying? Every You can't save some, some of these niggas ain't finna be saved. I ain't trying to save that motherfucker either. I just... Wipe my hands up and I'm done. I was like, I came back to, I came back to my senses. I was like, you know what? You're right, bro. You're right. You're having fun. You're having a good time. I'm going to let them niggas do that. For you beta males out there, do that shit if you want. That is the ultimate validation you can give a shit. You are literally just a puppet. You are a puppet in her hands. Letting shit happen like that. Absolutely degrading your masculinity. Like this shit is crazy, man. Don't ever let no shit like that happen. Don't ever let a female degrade you like that. How is she supposed to respect you? And it's not even like I was mad at the females. I'm mad at them because you just let a female degrade you like that. 
How the fuck? Of course she's going to try. She's going to see what she can get away with. It's up to you to not let that shit happen, though. And these niggas, oh, I'm just having fun. Yeah, have fun being a whack-ass nigga your whole life. Yeah, you definitely, oh, I get whatever. This nigga said I get whatever females. Yeah, you pay for the females that you want. That's what you do. Don't sit here and cap like I ain't finna call you out on it, bro. Y'all beta males is losing. And I know some of y'all don't understand. Okay, if he's having fun, what's wrong? Let me tell you something. For y'all beta males that don't understand what's wrong with that situation. Let me break this down to you. She literally took a sticky note, wrote bitch made in pink, in pink permanent marker, right? And slapped it on his forehead, then bent this nigga over, chopped his balls off. You're done. It's over. It's a wrap. Y'all beta males is losing. Straight up.